On today's episode of Mummy's Boy, I introduce Mum to Nicocado Avocado. I find out the meaning behind Skibbity Toilet Riz. And Mum introduces me to Flibbity Gibbet. <laughs> Remember to like and subscribe so you never miss an episode. It's Mummy's Boy. Hello and welcome to Mummy's Boy with me, Arthur Hill, and my adorable opulent. Oh! I literally have no idea what that means. Oh, why don't you know opulent. what anything means? Opulent, um, richly coloured. Opulent, and like a That's jewel. What it sounds like like a jewel. A jewel. I like producer mm. Jack for opulent. Deep down, I've always been a Mummy's Boy at heart, and in this weekly podcast, I get to spend some coloured time. Time. Quality time. Quality time. Yeah, like that. Hey, hey, Quality yeah. time with mum and receive some much needed advice that only a mother can give. But sometimes my mum needs help to TikTok, viral videos, social media, celebrities. These are all things which mum oh, thinks. It's going could well. Be a long day. These are all the. <laughs> These are all things which my poor mum just can't get her head around. So I'm here to help her before this modern world leaves her behind. God. Not only will I help her unravel the mysteries of youth and bring her into the digital age, but I'll also be making Lisa's motherly wisdom available to all of you as well. So if you're in need of advice or even just have a question or story that you are desperate for us to read, slide into our DMs on socials at Mummy's Boy Pod or send us a message or even a voice note to WhatsApp on 07822 013837. And no matter what the issue, I will ask her in a feature I like to call Mum, Can We Talk? <sighs> oh. Well. Oh. I'm on your side. Well, th I, this is very strange. This does feel weird. This is very strange. Not only are we sitting in these chairs again mm. without our table, but we're the wrong way round. <laughs> oh. It's crazy. It is a little bit Freaky, no, I, want, I said I wanted to be this side after I saw the podcast, which is shot in the same studio, Moon Underwater. What are you talking about? And I okay. was sat on the other side and I, I saw the oh, clips I and I went, oh. that's my side. Oh, so you think you've so, got a be one yeah. side better than the other. Yeah. And I'm Note, deliberately wore my think best about outfit. Asking. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And it's a lovely hat. It's I, a jaunty yeah, I figured, angle. I'd, yeah. Um, hmm. the whole bit that was we weren't going to mention it, Mum. I said, "Oh, was it?" <laughs> I said, "We're gonna, we're gonna, <laughs> we're gonna not mention it the entire episode." Oh, I wasn't listening. And you've done it in the first minute. Can we cut that? No, <laughs> do not cut it. Oh, oh sorry. You've ruined it. Oh no. Well, now what can you do? No, you can't take it off now. You've got a funny ridge. Oh, okay. Well, that's we'll sort of. The... Yeah, that's okay. Oh, you are a caution. Oh, dear. Who knows oh what I look dear. like? You it's look probably, fine. I won't allow this but to come you didn't, out. you didn't bother checking with me whether I thought I had a good side or not. No, obviously because not. You, because all no. of, your, yes, all of yes, it's great. Yes, okay. And I, I did say when I saw you just now for the first time in a while mm. that your hair looks great. Oh, you did actually. Doesn't it, guys? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> 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 It looks really nice. Does it? I like the colour of it, yeah. Do you? A lot, yeah. I'm very, very pleased. Mm -hmm. Thanks. And that's saying something. And apparently, this is my natural colour. Because I really just... I know, but my my grey is now so grey... That it's blonde. That this is the colour. It's not blonde, it's grey. It's sort of silvery. This is the colour that my hair comes out of my head. Wow. So now I won't have to go you to the hairdressers ever old. again. old. I'm really, really old. It yes. doesn't register that like you have grey hair. To me, I don't think. Doesn't it? It bloody well registers to me. Like, you don't look. He's about to say something nice. No, now he's not. Like, if I see someone that's 60 and I'll be like, she's she looks 60, but, like, you don't seem 60. Oh, Arthur. That's but that so must just nice. be, like, sun bias or something. Maybe. You probably look awful. Probably. But I think you look radiant. Radiant and yeah. opulent. Yeah. Hurrah. <laughs> Um, yes. Right. Come on then. Spit the modern world. The, the modern the world. The modern world that we are in. The modern world, which is very, very demure. No. Oh fuck's sake! When the, the, what do you mean, I'm no. bored of that. Oh, you're bored That's of done. that. That's done. That's done. I'm, but I've I'm used so. It. I can't actually explain how sick of that I am. Oh. Oh, okay. 
sodgy then. I, I've used it a couple of times in the car to calm me down. Wow. Really? Yes. In what scenario? To yourself? Yeah, just to myself. Just when people have been oh. getting on my nerves or I've been stuck in a, in a jam well, and fine. people have been behaving like idiots. And I've just said, no, 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 no. Everything's fine. You're very demure. You're very mindful. Wow. Yeah. And then you become a duck at the end. <laughs> I did sound a bit ducky, didn't it? It, did. it was supposed to be a <laughs> noise, not a... <laughs> never mind. Um, yes, what? There's more trends. The trends never oh, stop. No. Oh, the trends God. never now stop. What? And they will never stop until no, they the world won't, ends. They? Okay, come on. Terrifying thought. Yeah, um, go on then. What's the so new there's, one? So there's people are sort of advertising things now on TikTok. Right. Oh, you, but people your age Surely using not. like Gen Z slang. Are they? And it's doing very well. Oh, no. I think they must have seen me? our podcast. Oh, I God. Think. Are you going to test yeah. me? Oh, no. Sort of. There's, yeah, that we've, we've tested you before. Yes, you have. But I think we're going to have to test you again. Oh, hurrah. Um, because, yeah, as I said, it just keeps it coming. Keeps, it, it keeps coming. Evolving. Um, so oh, are Lord. you ready? No. Okay. Oh, no. Hits different AF. Hits different AF. Hits different AF. In a sentence, this song hits different AF. As fuck. As fuck is correct. But what does... Funny that I know that bit. Yeah. <laughs> what does... Hits, hits different. different. Hits different as AF. God, it just hits different. Like I would say, um, like, like just it, going on a line bite just hits different. It hits different. Every time it's different. Every time is exciting. No. <laughs> feels. Getting off the it's plane the when you're on... on when you land on holidays, just hits different. That first beer oh, really? on holiday just hits, hits different. different. AF. You Your new hair hits different. Oh, love it. Okay. Yeah, just yeah, it's, right. it's it's a, really good. It's yeah. Okay. Oh, that's quite that's quite cool. I could it hits you. I could use that different way. Actually, that's really good. Okay. Yeah. How would you use it in um, your daily life? Well, this life? is what I was just thinking. How could I that use that? That funeral hit different. Yeah, I don't think it works for funerals, really. <laughs> I don't think it does. No. Um, that blouse hits different. <laughs> blouse? Producer Jack, producer Jack needs a good spanking. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, didn't mean that. Cut. Uh, blouse? Where did you get that from? <laughs> Oh, God, he's... he's... It seemed like the sort of thing you'd say. Oh, did it? <laughs> oh, he's amusing. I've, I haven't used the word blouse for many a year. That blouse. I'll give you a blouse. Um, this is really weird sitting here because I can see producer yeah, we, Jack. We, you see, we I'm not this. used to that. I'm used to like, looking at him you know, when no one I know, else laughs you see. at a joke. Yeah, you see, no, this is interesting. That. This is very interesting. Mm. Yeah, you yes. see. Yeah, what did we call him? Oh, producer Spielberg. Oh, yeah. yeah. Spielberg. Ah, yeah. Oh. Um, okay, well, you, you didn't really, it took a lot of clues for you to get that. So well, I'm, I'm going to give you bit. half a point Thanks. if we're doing points. Yeah, okay. I actually don't know this one. Let's oh. go. So we're both learning. Guap. Guap. As in, I've made a guap. A boo boo. A mistake. <laughs> no. Oh. I've made a. Uh, I've, yeah, I've, I've made I've a delicious made a dinner. I've made a guap. Yeah, you can't, there's no point you just keep saying <laughs> the same I, thing. Yeah. I made oh, a guap. Could that, be anything. The, my, 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 oh no, how do I say <laughs> That job made me a guap. Made me a ton of money. Yeah. Did there it? you go. A, lot, a, guap a guap is a slang term for a large amount of money. God, Ooh. there's just never ending slang, term, slang terms for money now, isn't there? Are there? Bread. Wow. Bag. Swag. No. No. Point for swag trying, though. Swag is a no. thing? S well, yeah, it's a thing, but... Well, it's a lot of money, isn't it? Swag. Swag. Yeah, in a bag. No, no. A swag bag. <laughs> <laughs> swag is like no. what you wear. like what, like. what No, it isn't. No. Okay. Producer Jack. No. Swa but... uh, it's, okay, it's a really old-fashioned word, obviously, but we, you used to have a swag bag, which was a bag full of swag. <laughs> Ob's full of swag, which was money. Interesting. Yes. Can we confirm that? Yeah, please? he's googling now. Spielberg, because Mr. Spielberg is on it. Swag is 
is usually about like style and yeah. confidence demeanor or it's apparently it can also be an acronym slang uh word meaning stuff we all get swag free promotional so, or marketing items yeah you are um, completely I'm completely wrong. wrong yeah um it also in the old days was something to do with curtains <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah swags we used to have swags Mm. Like Austrian blinds, super and wives and girlfriends, super wives and girlfriends, and you had swags, things like that were sort of billowy. And yes, in the old days, yes. something to do with curtains. Oh, you see, producer Jack, he's learning so many things that he really didn't need to know. Okay, what was it? a guap? Like guap? Guap. Yeah. G U A P. G U A P. Nice. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Next one. Mm. Oh yeah, gassing. Gassing, chatting a lot, yeah, talking this is, too this much. This is interesting. This, is, this has changed meaning now for me. I thought it had a different meaning as well. Oh. Now I know how you feel. Um, Good. Oi, Julie, why are you gassing? What are you gassing for? Talking. No. Oh. Why are you gassing? Farting. No. <laughs> Reasonable. Could have been. Why, why are you gassing? Why are you gassing? There's no point. Why in, are you gassing? There's no point in just saying the same why are you, words. Why are you Arthur, gassing? Uh, why are you asking? No. Why? Are you, why are you gassing? Arthur, you really annoy right. me. Now. Why are you gassing? Arthur. Oh, is this a clue? No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was. How many ways can you say the same sentence? In the gassing, different... means lying. Lying. It is, in fact, a gas. Oh, very good. I'd love um, to have one of those. Yeah. But I thought, like, when you... Okay. No, gassing is gas normally is chit, chit, chat, chat. Chit, chit, chat, chat. No, chit, no, chat. it's like gassing, gassing you up. What does that mean? Like, if I, I'm, if I say I'm gassed, I'm really excited. Really? That is in my vocabulary. I do say that. Do you? Well, you're going to have to stop now because it means something else. Uh, yeah, I'm gassed for I'm gassed you're lying for tour now. or something. You know. Well, everyone's going to think you're lying if mm, you say I'm that. I'm lying for tour. Confusing. Oh, truth. Whoever is the head of the trends, yeah, needs Change to stop. Change that one. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Moving on. <laughs> cough, cough. Giving me life. Oh well, it's it's um, uh, it's uh, something this... that's making you feel fabulous. It's yeah. Giving you fair life. play. That's that's not new, is it? I wouldn't have thought so. No. no. Giving no. me Producer life. Producer Jack. Where did you get that yeah. one? Got to put some in you can get. Oh! 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 That way goes the game. Wow. Right. Tensions oh. rise. Oh. Okay. <laughs> fugly. Fugly? Fugly. As in, that baby is fugly. Ugly. Yeah. <gasps> Fuck ugly. Fuck ugly. Oh. Fucking ugly. <gasps> Would you say that to a baby? Well, I haven't personally. Oh my god! Fuck ugly. Oh fugly. no! Oh, that's horrible. That's a horrible word. I don't think that no, one should yeah. be in use. Fugly. Fugly. I think that I one's had its baby. had its time. I think that was a while ago. Was it? Yeah. Well, it's not very nice. No. No. Next. But you got it. I did. Bussin. Bussin. As in, yo, the gig was bussin. Oh, it was. Um... That cake was bussin. Oh, it was cool. It was vibey it was down it with the kids yeah Groovy. sure we'll take that, that means something is extremely good excellent amazing fantastic oh there you go Bussin. Yeah. skibbity riz <laughs> skibbity riz skibbity riz fucking hell I love it skibbity riz sounds like something that takis would say um catapliktiki skibbity riz interesting you think it's greek it's greek she thinks it's skibbity greek. riz no skibbity riz is um that toilet has skibbity riz. Oh, ooh. oh! I've gone off it now. I thought it was something nice, like skibbity riz, like Scooby Dooby Doo. <laughs> it's obviously not that at all. <laughs> oh, is it something gross? Is it something sticky? N no, no, no. Oh, <laughs> no. <laughs> riz is. Uh, I know what riz is. Riz, yeah. About. Is it something to do with riz? Kind of. Yeah, yeah. Oh, well, yeah. Skibbity. Even better riz. Even bigger me... riz than usual. He's really skilled at picking up women. He's got skibbity oh, riz. Really? Oh, really? Yeah. But I didn't know the original. Oh, I didn't know I skibbity that. toilet was yeah, a YouTube series. I didn't know that. But what, how do you? But hang I on, never how knew can what a skibbity, skibbity toilet was. 
What is a Skibbity? Is it true that Michael Bay is making a movie called Skibbity Toilet? I heard that. I don't know. I don't know what's happening. I'm. So, it came uh, off my Twitter. Sorry, but with John Witt, with uh, with um, Keanu Reeves. Keanu Reeves in it. <laughs> is this a joke? No, I, unless I've been pranked. I, it was on like a verified account. A verified account. Oh, a verified account. Verified. I thought you said verified, which I verified. wasn't sure what that was. But apparently yeah, never mind. True. Yeah, well, the skibbity toilet cinema is back. So, okay, but what is a skibbity toilet? I, I don't actually know. What skibbity know. Riz is, but skibbity yeah, I don't toilet. know what the skibbity skibbity refers to a viral cartoon series on YouTube called Skibbity Toilet. Riz <sighs> is slang for charisma. In the contents of skibbity toilet, in the in the contents of the skibbity toilet mean meme. Fucking hell. <laughs> I've literally got brain rot from this. A skibbity riz could refer to the charisma displayed by a male skibbity toilet to a female skibbity toilet. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Toilets are male and female. God damn it. And they're skibbities. So it's toilet on toilet riz. Oh, that's just completely Obviously. bizarre. Skibbity oh, it's like toilet. being on an episode of the Magic Roundabout. God. You went about them. That was Zebedee. Zebedee had lots of skibbity riz, I reckon. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Because it's a good job we're not on drugs. We'd be all over the place oh, no. by now. Carry on. It's sending me, as in this video is sending me. Oh, it's sending me somewhere fabulous. It's a bit like the other one yeah, that we had yeah, earlier. Yeah, it's just sending me, it's it's, making it's, me laugh loads. Yeah, yeah. Um, low key drip, as in you've got some low key drip. Post nasal drip. No. <laughs> really bad hay fever. No. Like low you're low-key key low pretty drippy, I think. I am? Yeah. I doubt that somehow. Low-key drip. Well, it doesn't sound very nice. I don't want to be low-key nice. drip. It's nice. good thing. Is it? It doesn't sound nice. Give me an example. You. you, you. Oh, that's it. Maybe me. I've got low-key drip on some days. Have you? Um. Yeah. Um, who else? Who else? Is it only the two of us? Well, I'm just trying to think of an example that... You've got low key drip, or you 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 sort of you display low key drip. You you no, you've got it. You've your, got it. You've got it. It's a bit drippy. Drippy. Drippy guy. Uh, uh, that guy's a drippy guy, man. Relaxed, chilled. Sort of. No, not no. No. Who's I was say, I don't think I'm chilled. Who would you know that's drippy? I don't know. Uh, it means something. Some some. Th <sighs> oh, something is really cool or stylish, but it isn't obvious. Low key drip. Oh. He's got some low key drip. Oh. And you think I've got a bit of low key drip? Yeah, exactly. Raw. Bro is low key drippy as hell. Carry on. He cooked, as in he got cooked. He got cooked. He got roasted. He got um, panned. Panned. Hmm. Uh, was that a word you don't he know? Got Cooked. He got cooked. He got. Bro got cooked. Bro. It means. Um, Skibbity bro got low key cooked. <laughs> <laughs> Skibbity gibbet. What's that? A flibbity gibbet. What? That's a word. Don't laugh, Adam. There is a <laughs> word called. There is a thing called a flibbity gibbet. <laughs> right. My That's mother used thing. to say it to me sometimes. Stop being such a flibbity gibbet. Mm. I have no idea what it is. Uh, but Brandon anyway, something awful, isn't it? Probably a silly, flighty person. Oh, okay. A silly, flighty person. There you are. That that's, could be a trend. That, yeah, that's. Couldn't it? That could be a new trend. Drop a hashtag flibbity gibbet flibbity in the gibbet. comments. Let's make it a thing. Let's make it a thing. Flibbity yeah, gibbet. Yeah, low key flibbity gibbet up yeah. your skibbity bob toilet riz. <laughs> oh, I can't remember them now. <laughs> Flibbity gibbet. Um, anyway, Let's what get were we talking about? Shirt. Oh, roasted, cooked, <laughs> cooked, cooked. Yeah, it means. Um, yeah, means to struggle, have problems, give yes. up, be defeated. Yes, yes. Okay, I've got like the receipts. Me. You've got the receipts. I've got the receipts. Oh, I'm glad someone has. I've I've got the receipts. That means. So be careful. I, I've got the receipts, bitch. <laughs> bitch, I have the fucking receipts. Okay, don't get nasty. Like. You oh. have no leg to stand on. I have the receipts. Oh, so I owe you money and there's no way I can get out of it because <laughs> you've got the receipts. <laughs> Sorry, you're right, yeah. I got the fucking receipts. <laughs> you can't get out of this, Tony. <laughs> yeah. I got the receipts. Well, it's got to no. be something like that, hasn't it? 
It's, you, you've got all no. the you've got all the facts, yeah, and I can't. Uh, so yeah. I don't have a leg. I've to got stand the evidence. On. The evidence. Yeah. that was the word. Often I was used after. to call someone out for lying. Oh, okay. For lying, the term for that was <laughs> far windy. <laughs> what was it? No way. It was something gassing. 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 There you are. Yeah. Well, that. God, that was only three minutes. Aged ago. me years. <laughs> Imagine how I feel. I know. You must feel more youthful. I think for me, it's the other way around. <sighs> what was the toilet one again? Oh, skibbity toilet. Skibbity toilet. Flibbity jib. Skibbity toilet. I love that. No, you don't. God. That's a great word. Skibbity riz. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm going to skibbity riz the way home. <laughs> I feel like it's sort of like a skipping word. Hmm. Could be in a musical, couldn't it? It definitely could. Skibbity Riz, the, the musical. Skibbity Riz. Skibbity Riz. <laughs> I like the idea of this being the moment where Skibbity Riz like became dead. Like yeah. Nobody wanted to use it <laughs> nobody anymore. Nobody ever want to use it. <laughs> it is officially dead. It is officially dead. <laughs> okay. Okay. Are we ready for two lies and a truth? Dear Lord, yes. I'm going to tell you three things Hurrah. and you have to guess which is the truth. Yes. I'll give you the answer in part two. Excellent. Ready? Work. Yes. American YouTuber Nicocardo Avocado. N pardon? Who? Nicocardo, Nicocardo Avocado. Recently revealed he'd been playing a two year long social experiment on his four million YouTube followers. <gasps> but what did he do? A, pretending to be one million of his own YouTube followers and showing he could sway public opinion on a range of topics, including the presidential election. Oh. B, uploading pre-recorded content of himself for two years and then revealing he'd lost 250 pounds of weight. C, revealing that instead of his own house, he'd actually been recording and posting video content from, in from inside prison without anyone realising. Oh. That would be so cool. Well, we'll find out after the break. Dun, dun, dun. It's mummy's boy. Welcome back. Thanks. But, mm, <laughs> Mum, before the break, we were playing Two Lies and a Truth. Yes, Are we you were. ready to give your answer? I jolly well am. Let's. Oh, I'm getting a phone call. Let's recap on the question, which was American YouTuber. Nicocardo Avocado recently revealed he'd been playing a two-year-long social experiment on his four million YouTube followers. But what did he do? A. Pretending to be one million of his own YouTube followers and showing he could sway public opinion on a range of topics, including the presidential election. I wouldn't let him do that. B. <laughs> uploading pre-recorded content of himself for two years and then revealing he'd lost 250 pounds somewhere down the toilet. <laughs> 250 pounds of weight. Yes. Revealing that in, instead of his own house, he'd actually been recording and posting video content from inside prison without anyone realising. Well, for a start, I just can't get over his name. So I'm already... Nicocardo Avocado. Nicocardo... That's his birth name as Avocado. well. Avocado. Mm. Don't be ridiculous. That's such a ridiculous name. Um, so I'm... So it can't be C because... Well, I'd be very worried if it was C because if he's able to do that from prison something's very wrong mm. with the penal system in the US oh, I agree uh, the one about losing weight oh, it's a bit boring I like the first one myself I'm going for A pretending to be one million of his own YouTube followers yes that's very very smart I would have definitely not gone for that one you idiot oh, oh bloody hell you Arthur. have not got one wrong, right in ages Oh, well, which one is it? Of course he can't it? pretend to be one million of his own YouTube followers. Can't he? No. Can't he just... Oh, and sway the president. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I hadn't really thought it through. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, I hadn't Absolutely absurd. Oh, well, which one was it? It was B. Oh, was it? It was. The oh, popular mukbang... Oh. Remember the mukbang? I do remember mm. the mukbang. YouTuber known for eating enormous amounts of oh, food on him. camera. No, it's not him. There's, oh. there's many mukbang people. Oh. 
fooled the internet by completing a secret weight loss journey while uploading old videos to mask his progress. His video titled oh. Two Steps Ahead has at the time of recording over 30 million views. It took Nicardo Avocado two years to lose the weight, going from 411 pounds at its heaviest to 158 pounds today. I don't know what that is in old money. 17 stone. 17 stone. 17 stone is what he ended up as. He lost 17 stone. He lost 17 stone. God, oh, blimey, yeah. that's a lot. That's, yeah. He Ooh. said, I've been strategically posting pre-recorded videos for two years on both YouTube and TikTok. I edited the video so they would appear recent, allowing me to focus on healing my body behind oh, the scenes. Perry wrote in an email, I shaved my head so that people wouldn't recognise me in public. A handful of fellow YouTubers also helped to keep the secret. Yeah, oh, I have feelings on this. On him. We'll, we'll, oh, we'll see what no. he looked like before and after, though, before. <laughs> uh, so this is what he looked like before. Yeah. Oh, dear. Yes, that's quite large, isn't it? Yes. Mind you, surrounded by food. Mm, well, that's oh, the, what the mukbang. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. And this is a clip of his reveal video. So I am the villain because I've made myself one. And you will continue to consume these stories about me year after year after year. For as long as I tell the internet that I am the villain. Stories that permeate and linger and infect the minds of the ants. I don't know why he thinks he's some kind of fucking genius. Oh, bloody hell. He's yeah, like I, I've Voldemort never ever watched on... this guy. And I was just like, everyone's, he's saying it's like some incredibly smart social experiment. All you did was bank content. That's all you did. And then lost a bunch of weight. Yes. I'm not saying it's like very impressive what no, he's done. No, it's fantastic that you lost weight, but I don't, weight, why it's but like I don't some, understand like, that. Why is it a social experiment? Yeah, no, it isn't. It's it's his experiment on himself. Like, what was the what social aspect person? of the experiment that people believe what they see? But it wasn't like it wasn't real. It was just lo- like further ago, longer ago. God, <laughs> I'm in no position. Well, I personally, I think he probably did in and fact he's a, he's win a weird the bloke. election for someone else way back. It's probably him. What? It's all to do with the election. Right. I think you're wrong. Mm. I don't think it was B. No. Yeah. <laughs> I think it was A. Well, maybe he could, but he yeah, seems like see? he you seems see? like he has the power. Indeed. To change mm. the minds of the election votes. It's mummy's boy. Okay, mum, <laughs> can we talk? I'm not sure. Right. Are you ready for some mum, can we talk correspondence? I said I'm not sure. Well, fucking make your mind up. Oh, get on with it then. Question one yes. from Anna. Anna. Hello, Arthur and Lisa. Hello. I just wanted to ask, what would you do if you found a proposal ring box from your partner? <gasps> a proposal ring box? Yes. What, with nothing in it? Because I have. Oh. I also... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I also may or may not have already looked in it and it's a big fucking rock. Oh. You just be patient. Should I act surprised when he proposes? Oh. Question mark, question mark, question mark. Because I already know he will do it on a holiday in October. Oh, At least no. I know how it looks, right? Should I tell him that I found it already or keep it between myself? Please help me. Keep it between myself. <laughs> <laughs> Please help me, a.k.a. Wahamad. Pardon? It's an acronym, WWE. How am I meant to know what that is? <laughs> what the fuck? It, it explains it in the next bit. Just read oh. it. And then read, <laughs> just be patient. <laughs> AKA WWAHAMHD. Oh. What would Arthur Hill and Mummy do? Oh. <laughs> God. <laughs> Dear Lord. Sorry, right. What would Arthur Hill and Mummy Hill do? Oh, that is quite a tricky one, isn't it? But you don't know when it's going to happen. No, but, but you why see... Does she, but she thinks she knows. She thinks she knows and it's going to be on holiday. And then it's going to be like a Love Actually thing where it's actually for someone else. Well, that's that would be my thing. What's that the Joni be... Mitchell song? 
I was about to sing Tales Old of Time. <laughs> from both sides now. No. That's the song. Yeah. Um, he should have hid it better. Yeah. That would be my, my first thing would be, for heaven's sake, you Burke, why didn't you hide it better? Agreed. Because, you know, you leave it lying about. Yeah. I think. Oh. She I can't think mention it. She can't mention it. She got that surprised. Oh, no, it's going to ruin it. Well, it's, she's, it's ruined anyway. Well, now, yeah, there's no it? way it's, it's not ruined. ruined. Oh, no, that's awful. Oh, I know. Dump him. Yeah, start you're going to have to dump him and start again, Oh, no, again, she said it was a good big one, didn't she? What was? Oh, you know how Daddy proposed to me, don't you? Do you? EastEnders. Yes, no, we, we froze mine in a... Why have I got that on there? He, uh, he froze <laughs> mine into an ice, an ice cream, into an ice cube and put it in a gin and tonic. Wow. Whilst we were watching EastEnders and I nearly swallowed it. Incredible. <laughs> that's so bizarre. <laughs> it is quite bizarre, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. But that's your daddy. That's the daddy. Well, uh, Anna, <sighs> I'd, I, mm, yeah, that is quite it's difficult. It's a tough one. Arthur thinks you can't say I, anything. Yeah, I think you've got and, to pretend because he opposite. feels so shit. I know, but Spent he's going to feel money. shit if when he, he gets, they get on their holiday and he gets down on one knee and doesn't, she goes, oh, I knew you were going to do that. Maybe just tell him not to do it on the holiday. No. Tell him you know and tell him not to do it on holiday and then you will never know when it's coming. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Yeah. Okay, oh, well, good luck, Anna. That is hard. And, well, and congrats prem prematurely. Yes, exactly. Um, oh. Question two oh. from Fanny. 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 Face, feet and Fanny. Always need a wash. They're three sisters, actually. Who? Face, feet and Fanny. That's who it's from. Be silly. Hey Arthur and Mama Hill, do you think shampoo and conditioner are friends outside the bathroom, or is it purely professional? <laughs> <laughs> oh well, wow. there's a question. Friends outside the bathroom? No, no, I think they'd probably be sworn enemies. Actually, you think so? Yeah, I do. I reckon there's a great deal of tension between. I think them. it's sort of like a Liam Gallagher, Noel oh, Gallagher maybe situation. Maybe it is. Maybe it is. But every now and then, they this just feels have to like work this together. is something we could act out. I think. No, it really doesn't. I think it is. Arthur, let's do oh. shampoo and conditioner bumping into each other <laughs> at an event. <laughs> oh God! After. Okay, I'm going yeah, to be they knew, They were in a bathroom together three years ago, and oh. since then they haven't seen each other. <laughs> okay. And they um, bump yeah. into each and other at an your, event. Your no, I feel I'm shampoo. Your conditioner. Oh, okay. I'm yeah. conditioner. Yeah. Okay. I'll be at the bar. Okay. And you can spot me. <gasps> oh, my. Well, hang on, let me. Oh, okay. Sorry, I was just getting cracking yeah. on. Okay. Oh, my. I'll have a. D <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll go a third time, Sucky. I'll have a dirty mar martini, please. A dirty martyr. Who? Sorry? Go on. Sorry. Start again. Hello. No. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> what is wrong with us? Because you said to be quick today. We've just been utterly <laughs> shite. I'm so sorry. Okay. Right, go. Hi, bartender. I'll have a, a, one dirty martini, please. <gasps> oh, mon dieu. Is it you? Conditioner. Yes. Shampoo. Oh, my word. I cannot believe you are here. I have not seen you since... <gasps> It must be... 2021 20, in, in Lily's bathroom. In that bathroom. Oh, we had so we were many... Good team. Oh, we had so many good times in that bathroom. But you ran out much after me. I did. She did you, not use me enough. But what was it like after I was gone? It was quite dull. I did not know what to do. I had a new what shampoo. shampoo. What new shampoo did she use? Then tell me. I, well, I have to know. You will not be happy. You will not be happy. Don't tell me it was Tresemme. It was not Tresemme. If it was Tresemme, I would have been happy. But no, it was the co-op on brand. I died for nothing. You did. You did. But Even he you cannot save it from that. I did my best. She doesn't look bad. No. <laughs> <laughs> wow. And, and scene. scene. <laughs> I can't believe we're talking to each other like uh, shampoo yeah. and conditioner. How lovely. That was good. That was lovely. That was great. Well, I hope that's helped. Um, who was it? Can't remember. Fanny. Fanny. <laughs> 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 
the way that went makes me think that maybe they're not. I maybe think they're that, friends. Yeah, actually, they did seem I quite did literally chummy. give you the brief that we'd be enemies, but it's fine. You did. Sorry, I got I carried away with, with myself. Um, I was so pleased to see you yes. as a shampoo. Mm. So maybe they, yeah, I think they'd be friends. Yeah, they're I think important they'd be their to friends. each other. They need each other. They need each other. Yeah. Yeah. But that's a very good point, though, that obviously the shampoo always does end up going yeah. in the bin before the conditioner. So the mm. conditioner's always going to be a bit lonely. It's always widowed. Yeah. Oh. Mm. Thank you, Fanny, for that. Yes. That was really fun. And, remind, yeah, just made me realise that, you know, we need each other like shampoo and conditioner. Who, you and me? Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Um, exactly. Oh. Always like... remember, new episodes every Wednesday and Sunday. <laughs> and if you're in need of advice or even just have a question or story that you are desperate for my mum to read, slide into the DMs on socials at Mummy's Boy Pod or give me a message on WhatsApp on 07822 013 837. And no matter what the issue, I will ask her. <gasps> Arthur, you didn't look. <laughs> bye. Oh, bye. It's mummy's boy.